It was a sea of color at Waterford as Combo Mayor held their Interhouse Sports and the 200s will be our highlights. Starting with the under 13 girls, Division 4, and she dominated all day winning the 400, the 100, and now add to that the 200 title. Her name is Josiah Ford in the green of set D. She had them done and dusted, registering a time of 30.57 seconds. And not that second and third was Kalia Waterman and Hannah Wallace. And just like four, the star boy of the under-13s is Delaney Burke, coming off the bend in this 200 a dominant form. Just like the four and the one, the others were merely playing catch-up, going down the home stretch in full flight, and he crossed the line in 28.20 seconds, four set C, ahead of Shamario Allen Whitaker of set D, and the Sean Brown of set B, who dips in for third. There's a trend at Waterford with athletes sweeping events, and it continued in the under 15. Here she comes, decked in the yellow of set C, arms pumping, feet turning over, and her focus was the finish line. Savannah Thorne, no catching her today, nor tomorrow. It's now her and the clock, and she'll come home in 27.36 seconds. Here come the under-15 boys off the bend and the orange shirts looking dominant, leading them in the middle of the field, Amari Small. He takes revenge for his second place in the 100. When he comes up big in the two, set F, he's your winner. 25.85 seconds, the fight for a second claim by Keone Harris of set A over set B's Alex Simmons. We're moving into the big leagues, the under-17 girls and some familiar names in the lineup, like the Applewick twins Tia and Tania. Tunisia Brand is there as well, off the bend and it's still anyone's for the taking. But then Tia engages in extra gear and she steps past the rest. It's all hers. The whale fight now behind her and it'll be Crystal Benson from Zara Giddens and Brian. Talk about a close one. The boys' equivalent ran pretty much the same as off the bend. There was no denying who was in charge. Darian Belgrave had the rest seeing red. Set B all the way. Zaire Griffith chasing him down, but would have to settle for that second place as Belgrave's winning time was 23.15 seconds, Griffith 23.73 take out the phones as we go on to the under 20s the girls first a stacked feel and the form shows it approaching the final 100 meters i couldn't call it as yet but into the straight thing shaped up as kelia benton was into the business end of things she was not playing as she pulled away to take the win her 100 silver is now 200 gold and here comes a fast finishing Danae now is closest to the screen nipping the sprint champion alika here within to third the times 25.49, 25.93, and 25.98. And the big boys. We take it from start to finish. In the lineup, the one everyone wants to beat. Reigning fastest schoolboy in BIM, Aragon Straker in the black. In the green shirt on his shoulder, Tion Hayes, National Junior Athlete of the Year. Off the bend, and these two go at it. Stride for stride. But then Straker as the NOS. And it's all over. He's a kingpin in Waterford. Coming through in 21.87 seconds. A new school record. The old one of 22 flat from 2006 is gone in the win. Haynes time was 22.11. While Nathan Brayfield was third in 22.97. Watch out. The Commonwealth team will be coming strong for BSAC 2024.